Hi. Um, I just got a Kindle Fire for Christmas. And uh, besides using it as a, a, a Kindle reader, of course, uh, I uh, wanted to use it as a, a tablet for drawing cartoons because I'm a cartoonist. However, in the uh, styluses that are available in the industry, a big problem is, is that all these styluses have a large end to it. For example, this one here. This large end makes it very difficult in drawing fine lines, obviously, on the small screen on a uh, Kindle Fire. So I decided to try to figure out how to do a stylus that would have a smaller tip and one that could be uh, easily made at home. And after looking at a bunch of videos, uh, I decided that the simplest stylus that you could make would be uh, quite simple. And uh, all you need is a cotton bud, aluminum foil, scissors, and that's it. And for the conductivity of the stylus, you need a glass of water. So let's get started. First thing you do is you cut the aluminum foil into a strip that you will then wrap around your cotton bud to allow, always allowing just a small tip of cotton to um, at the end of it. So you just wrap it up real tightly. Now you want the cotton bud to con to uh, basically look like this. And that's uh, going to be your stylus. Now, the way you make it work is you dip it into the water and you dry the tip off a little bit. But the water is important because now you have conductivity from your fingers to the stylus. So let's turn on my uh, new Kindle Fire. Uh, something that my kids and my wife got me for Christmas. And still trying to figure out how to turn it on. And as you see, there's that yellow bar that uh, indicates you have to turn it on. Well, you take the stylus, you drag it on, and there, lo and behold, it's open. And it's now open, actually, to a, uh, a word processing program, or at least input into a uh, something. So uh, basically, you can let's see if I can get that on the screen. If you... Uh, Sorry about the reflection, but basically you can use this to uh, turn on whatever you want on that. Now let's get to the program that I uh, got it this, uh, got the Kindle for, and that is to a program that allows me to draw cartoons because I'm a uh, a cartoonist amongst other things, including being an author. And uh, this is a cartoon app on the uh, Kindle Fire. It's called Sketchbook Mobile. It costs 99 cents. And you click it on. Now again, I'm just using this cotton bud stylus, as you can see. And I've got something on it, but let's uh, take that drawing off. And as you see, I just took it off. Uh, again, oh, wait, let's see if we can get it. And you get the Sketchbook app, and you pick a pen. And by using this stylus, let's see if we can get the nice view of it here. OK, here's a good view. You can draw to your heart's content. And um, all you have to do to make it work, let's turn my smiley face right side up, is um, get a cotton bud, aluminum foil, and a little drop of water. And then uh, you can draw cartoons. So I've got a couple of cartoon books on Amazon right now. Uh, one called Strange, There's Strangeness in the Universe, and another one called Happy Holidays and Other Tragedies of Life. And I also have a, a novel called um, Falling Star. And if I can get those on here, I'll certainly show you my um, 
books and I will the books I have are there's strangeness in the universe and let's turn that one off because we don't want to do that right now falling star and doing all of this as you can tell with just my cotton ball stylus and that's how you do it. And the whole thing will cost you, uh, assuming your wife will let you have the aluminum foil for free, and the cotton buds are probably less than a penny, and water uh, is relatively free. So this dollars costs probably less than a penny. Thank you very much.